YouTube, Rook here from Rook Geek Goodness, my little channel and web for all things geeky and cool. And this video, guys, is another Funko review. We'll be taking a look at an item that just dropped about a week, week and a half ago, as far as recording this video, from the Funko Shop. This is a limited edition piece, a special two-pack for Edgar Frog, Alan Frog, the Frog Brothers from the Lost Boys movie. Now, Lost Boys was a movie that came out in 1987, one of Corey Feldman's breakout roles. If you've never seen the Lost Boys movie, I highly recommend watching it. It's a weird different take on vampires. They play up to a lot of the tropes. A lot of the really cool ideas for vampirism and vampires themselves really came from Lost Boys. So I highly recommend watching that movie. Great movie, great soundtrack. Soundtrack was awesome for that film. So we'll do a full breakdown segment with these two guys here. We're gonna look at the packaging as a whole. We'll look at the paint articulation and conclude in final thoughts for you, the viewer. Should you actually pick up the limited edition Funko Shop Lost Boys two pack for Edgar Frog and Alan Frog? the Frog Brothers. Stay tuned guys, we're going to a breakdown. All right guys, we're in a breakdown segment looking at the Pop Movies Funko Shop Limited Edition 2-Pack Edgar Frog, Alan Frog, the Frog Brothers from the Lost Boys movie. And the very first thing we always do is look at the packaging and presentation. Packaging looks really good, standard sort of 2-Pack design. We have the Pop Movies symbol right here. It does say Frog Brothers 2-Pack. Both figures represented in a window box display. You have the all-important FunkoShop.com little sticker. You have a shop of Edgar Frog, the Lost Boys logo, and Alan Frog. On this side, it does say Edgar Frog, two-pack with a picture of his face, and the same thing with Alan Frog right there, picture of his head and a two-pack symbol. On the back, we have the figures that were available in the Lost Boys wave right here. You had, uh, I think it was Michael, you had Sam, and you had David, and you have, of course, the back shots of Edgar Frog and Alan Frog, the Frog Brothers. So let's actually get both these guys out of packaging and continue the breakdown segment. All right, guys, we have Edgar Frog and Alan Frog out of packaging. The very first thing we always do after we unbox a Funko product look at the paint and articulation. Since this is a two pack, we'll do them one by one. We'll take Alan Frog out of the shot and focus on Edgar Frog. Of course, this is Corey Feldman's character, Edgar Frog, one of the two characters who ran a comic book store in the movie by day and they were vampire hunters by night. They took the character literally from Lost Boys and transitioned him into vinyl figure form. It's about as close as you can get for a human representing in vinyl figure form for Corey Feldman's character, Edgar Frog. It looks really, really good. The paint is very clean, very solid throughout the entire figure. Brown hair, big black eyes. He does have his little steak in his hand and his canteen. He's wearing uh, fatigues, military camouflage clothing. I'll kind of go a little slowly so you can see the paint they use. It looks really, really nice. Showcasing black boots and his blue bandana that hangs off the side right here. Now, articulation is pretty solid. Head will spin. 360 degrees. It kind of gets caught on the sides right here of these stakes, which I'll go to the back of the figure so you can see. There are two stakes that are sculpted in place right there, and the head sometimes gets caught when you spin it, so you might get some rubbing of the vinyl material, so definitely keep your eyes on that. Now, he's very, very thin. His body is very thin, and his head is extremely heavy with all the tooling on the back of the head and those stakes. He has a tendency to fall backwards a lot. If this is happening to yours like that, if you see it happening to yours, Simply bend the head forward a little bit or maybe some warm water to loosen it up so you can readjust the head. That should fix the problem. Let's take Alan, let's get Edgar out of the shot and grab Alan. Now let's take a look at the Alan Frog figure. Between the two figures, I think this is the weaker of the two figures. He does have this really neat beret that kind of slants to the side, as you can see right there. It looks really, really cool. Sort of a black matte color uh, articulation. There's no hindrance. He spins all the way around. He has no weaponry that he's carrying. He does have big black bold eyes. He has black hair, very short cut, as you can see. Um, no weaponry. His shirt is open, showcasing a kind of a, uh, I would say like a skull shirt right there. Uh, Fatigues looks really nice, goes through the entire figure all the way down with big black boots. But between this figure here and the Edgar figure right here, I would say the Allen figure is much weaker compared to the Edgar figure. And then running joke, of course, is the Edgar Allen as an Edgar Allen Poe. If you had to get only one of the figures, meaning if you were buying them separately, buy the Edgar figure. But if you buy them collectively, get the two pack as a whole. I would think they works a lot better off each other as a two pack as opposed to individual individual figures if you're getting them separately by the Edgar figure, but buy them both as a two-pack in my honest opinion. And with that being said, let's go to final thoughts and wrap up this video.
All right, guys, final thoughts on the Pop Movies Funko Limited Edition 2-Pack Edgar Frog, Alan Frog, the Frog Brothers from the Lost Boys movie. I think this is definitely a buy as a collective piece, both these guys right here, but I would buy with a caveat. You had to have liked the Lost Boys movie. If you didn't like the movie, you shouldn't buy these two pieces. I did mention that they, from the beginning of the video, they took a lot of tropes from vampirism and turned them on its head in that movie. Things like killing the lead vampire. You see those sort of tropes that were picked up and moved into more modern vampire movies that originally really came from the Lost Boys movie when it talked about vampires and vampirism. I love that movie. I love both these guys right here. Price point wasn't too bad for the Funko store. It was about $30 US. Price now isn't that high either. It's about $40 to $45 again US. The biggest negative I see on this two pack is Edgar Frog, meaning he's extremely back heavy. As I see, and I've been playing around with this figure a lot, he usually tips backwards all the time because he has a lot of stuff on his back his hair is very very long in the back and as well as those stakes they give him a lot of back heft and it has a tendency to flip backwards all the time maybe it's just mine but I see it happening when I'm messing around with the figures so please be aware of that and that'd be probably the only negative I really have to say for this two pack as a whole so I hope you like this video review definitely click that like button always click subscribe when you subscribe to the channel click the bell and kind of be notified of my latest videos of course last but not least, you can click Windows over here to watch more of my content. Take care, guys. I'll see you next video, and bye-bye.